Hey, what's up there guys? Corey here with Gotta Be Mobile, and today we're going to show you how to quickly edit video on the Samsung Galaxy S8. Now, like most Galaxy devices or any new Galaxy devices, Samsung has a basic, somewhat advanced video editor on the phone. When you record any video, go ahead and open it in the gallery. You can click the edit button and do kind of some of those simple things like trim and add filters and what have you. So when you go to a video file, you have some trimming options and effects and you can add some audio and, and that's about it. If you want to just trim video, it's already included. But there's a hidden Samsung Galaxy video editor on every phone. You just have to download it from the Galaxy App Store, which is built into every Samsung phone. So go ahead and find a video from your gallery. And once you find one, hit the edit button. And when you find the video, you come down here to Movie Maker. And this is actually a download for Movie Maker or the video editor is what it was previously called on Galaxy devices. So what you have to do is actually download and install the video editor and Movie Maker first from Samsung. And this gives you all the tools that aren't available by default on the phone that are powerful to enhance your videos. So go ahead and download that and we'll get into this video momentarily. Okay, and once you've downloaded the official Samsung Electronics Movie Maker app, you can either open it from the Galaxy App Store or back in your gal gallery, simply hit the video edit button again, and it will start the video editor. So from here, you have a basic menu for some of your projects. So you go ahead and come in here, and to start, we have multiple options for projects. You can add a video, you can add images, you can record video on the fly to kind of enhance your video edits as you go. So go ahead and go into the camera, select a video, maybe select two videos, and hit done. So here, the full Samsung Galaxy video editor is now available. From here, um, Samsung starts off with a couple of little overlays and effects and custom kind of themes, almost like a filter, but with their own versions of a video editor if you don't want to do all the work yourself. Go ahead and go back to custom or even any of these and then customize them as you go to build on top of Samsung's. So hit done, and now we are in the basic video editor. From here you can see a couple of options. You can swipe, everything swipe based and nice friendly, you know, touch screen controls. You can shrink or expand your video. And if you come right here into the middle, you have options to add transitions, get some transitions in your videos, change the duration, and scroll over a little bit more. And we have effects, you can trim, add text, change the speed, increase the volume, and this works per audio clip. You can change the volume and then come over here and change the volume for the next one to kind of match your audio clips together. You can rotate and zoom. So go ahead and add some of that. Get your video the way you like it. While you're at it, you can come over here and hit add. And uh, we can go back right into here and add more videos. But then additionally, you can add photos, audio, more titles, and kind of add to your video even more. And then once you add anything you'd like, go ahead and you hit done. And you can play your video to see the progress watch it full screen, and as you can see, there's a lot of different options for Samsung's video editor. The basic app on the phone by default is just pretty limited, but once you expand into this, there's a lot more options to kind of take your content to the next level. So, once we're done and we've added a couple of animations and effects and some backgrounds and music or layers, or whatever you'd like to do, make sure you save your video, and Samsung gives you an option for a few different a few different sizes. So if you'd like, you can do standard def or HD or full HD is an option as well. So choose a video you'd like, hit save, and that is it. That is the hidden Samsung Galaxy Video Editor on every Galaxy device, Galaxy S8, Galaxy Note 8. It's just kind of hidden by default, and once you download and open it, you now have full access to more controls to improve your videos. That's it, guys. Thanks for watching. See you next time.